What's up everybody, it's your boy Lewis Knight, and here's my review for Blasters of the Universe VR Bullet Hell for the PSVR, played through on the PS4 Pro. Real quick, just want to thank the developers at Secret Location for supplying me with the code to review. Alright, so here's the story. Starts off with Grandmaster Alwyn, who's the master of the arcade, who's gone on to be every single game in the arcade, including everyone's favorite, Blasters of the Universe, becoming number one on all the leaderboards. Quarter after quarter, nobody can beat this guy. He's unstoppable. Alwyn gets word that there's a new version of Blasters of the Universe coming in, and it just so happens that version is a VR version. He's so excited, without hesitation, he straps on the helmet, transports himself into a new universe, starts creating new worlds and new enemies, and it's your job to take them and his punk ass down. For the gameplay, Blasters uses two move controllers for your left hand or your right hand, whichever one you choose, for your gun or your shield. With the move controllers in hand, players must use one to deflect complex projectile patterns and the other to assault the enemies coming at you. When you die or pass a level, you can come back to the armory, choose new attachments and upgrades to make your gun better, faster, and stronger. Any playstyle can be accommodated with over 130,000 ways to customize and tweak loadouts to match offensive and defensive preferences. Alright, so things start off pretty simple here. You're fighting off your first few waves of enemies, you're dodging the bullets with your head, and you're blocking them with your shield. The bullets can only hit your head, they won't hit your body. You get bonus points for near misses and headshots. If you get hit in the game, time slows down for a couple of seconds, giving you a little bit of time to readjust. Each level is equipped with its own unique boss battle in which you'll have to defeat to get to the next level. The levels get harder and harder with the enemies getting more and more difficult, the patterns of the projectiles getting more difficult, figuring out where you're going to put your head, where am I going to dodge, am I going to use my shield, go this way, go that way, before you know it, there's projectiles everywhere, you're not going to know which way to go, and then it's game over, and you got to start the level all over again. But, you go back to the armory, check out all your stuff that you've unlocked, anything you've unlocked for your gun, build it back up, make it stronger and better. For the graphics, I really enjoyed the graphics in this game. I thought they were really good and slick. The neon colors, I thought the art design was really cool looking. And uh, the clarity, and the, it's really clear. There's no like blurriness or anything like that. It was really good. I enjoyed the graphics in this game. The sound effects were really good, too. I really enjoyed the sound effects with the, the, the guns and all the different types of uh, shields that you got. The, um, the voice acting was pretty good. It was, uh, you know, the one guy pretty much talking trash to you the whole time. And the music was pretty good, too, uh, with it being kind of like intense and fun at the same time. Really enjoyed the sound effects. Really good stuff. Alright, so overall, I really enjoyed the game. Um, I'm pretty much not finished with it, but I'm, I am enjoying it. I love going back to the armory to see what new stuff I unlocked and to put my guns together. What, what can I make now? What can I do now to, to get past this level? I'm having a good time with it. The game is really colorful. It's really fun. The game is only like $15 in the US right now, and it's on 10% for pe people without PS Plus. Uh, and 15% with people with PS Plus in America and in the uh, Europe. So I think it's a well worthy addition to the PSVR wave shooter genre. Uh, I'm having so much fun with it. I can't say enough. It's, it's a great game. It's a great price. Great colors. Great graphics. Pretty fun. I, I'm enjoying the game so far. That's my review. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, smash the like button. Subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Love y'all.